this fantastic adventure. Um, I'll share with you a little later on some pretty big news. Uh, certainly for me and I think for this channel, it's gonna be one of the highlights of the year. But first, we've got top marks, and the number one thing is I'm able to take you guys along for this journey, which just puts a massive smile on my face. I'll talk a little bit more about it later on when I get on the uh, channel tunnel because I've got about a 45 minute sort of uh, sit and wait on there. But in short, it is 12 months, give or take a week, since Top Marks last year. And that for me is a significant milestone which I'll share with you later on. And I actually just wanna say a, a massive thank you to everyone. But I'll explain that when we get on the channel tunnel. For now, we have open roads in front of us, sticky Trofeo R tires on this, and this beautiful 675 LT on its first road trip outside of the UK. Thank you, and hear me out. So give or take a week, it was roughly 12 months ago that it was Top Marks Monaco 2016. And before then, up until that point, I'd been uploading sporadically every now and again. And while the channel had been like slowly growing and feedback had been good, I hadn't actually made a cognitive decision to take YouTubing seriously. And it wasn't until Top Marks last year that I thought, right, I'm on the road. It's going to be the best part of two weeks. It's going to be content gold. This is the time where I either need to treat it as a jolly and just embrace it as a road trip or really hammer out the content. And thankfully, I decided to really hammer it out. And since then, the channel, the followers, the audience, and the opportunities, and this is what I'm getting around to, um, have just been beyond my wildest dreams. And now, when I started th this channel, it wasn't, I, I never intended it to grow to the stage that it's got to. Beyond my wildest expectations, never did I think that I'd be sat here 12 months later, what, we're on like 217,000 subscribers now? Um, and what is fantastic, and what means the most to me, is that when I read through the comments and the community that we've built, it's incredible because as we all know, the comment section in YouTube can be a pretty dark place. But I'm incredibly thankful and it's, it's incredibly humbling to read through the comments on the majority of the content that I get to share with you guys. And everyone in there is just so cool. You're all genuine, passionate, lovely petrol heads. Uh, and it is just a delight to be able to, every time I click that upload button, it gives me joy and I really look forward to reading uh, what you guys have to say. But the reason I'd want to say thank you is that regardless of me uploading if 
one person or one million people watch. What has transpired from having a fantastic audience such as yourselves is the invites that the channel has received and the doors that it's opened. And what that has allowed for is me to reciprocate by being able to provide great content. Some of the opportunities that this channel has had over the last 12 months have been insane. And, it, you know, if I was filming this and there was only one person watching, quite simply those doors would never have been opened. So it is as a, a result of you guys watching it that I in turn get invited to really cool stuff and I'm able to return it back to your eyeballs. <laughs> so yeah, I genuinely wanted to say thank you. Anyway, we're on Channel Toll now for about half an hour. I'm gonna finish this coffee to wake my ass up and then we're gonna hit the road with Sam and Paul in the brand new cars. Let's hit it. We've been talking about on social media, we've been talking about between us as friends, and it's just a moment that for me really kickstarts the whole supercar season. And monumentally, it might sound simple, but for me it's the first time that the LT has been outside of the UK on a proper road trip. We're back on Trofeo R, sticky tires, there's beautiful mountain roads waiting for us. And I just I just can't wait. I cannot wait to share this journey with you guys. So, what is the big deal with this trip? Well, we are ultimately, after top marks, we are extending the trip by a further few days. We're heading over to Rome in Italy for the first drive of the brand new McLaren 720S. So, with the experience of this being so profound from a driving point of view for me, and I'm about to drive their brand new car which is supposed to supersede this, I'm quite nervous. I've also put my money where my mouth is, and I've ordered one, so this car better be good. on Lake Annecy for the evening and check out the view. One of the best things about road trips is the places you end up, the people you get to meet, and the places you get to see are always rather spectacular. Look at this place. It's absolutely stunning. So I think for the rest of the evening, uh, we're just gonna take it steady and chill. Today really, essentially, has just been quite a lot of mundane miles. It only got interesting once we arrived here and now it's really starting to warm up. We're now gonna hop inside, catch up with the Formula One and probably call it a day. As always guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Ciao. I think it's gonna be Vettel Verstappen. on the Rebel is all over Hamilton. Mm. The 
Oh, oh, oh man, it's so close. So close, dude. No, I 